I'm at the end of the game, uh, whatever they land on, my winnings will multiply by those numbers, so that's very, very valuable. What's going on, everybody? AMV Coinbuster here, back with a brand new High Limit Coinbuster video for you all today. In today's video, we're going to be doing a $10 million buy in, and they gave us 1,000 quarters to get started today. Very, very expensive game, but luckily, 1,000 quarters should be way more than enough to knock down this humongous wall and potentially get the whole machine cleared out. Uh, we do need to win some $1 chips throughout the game just to keep our quarter count way up there. So uh, hopefully they got some $1 chips hidden underneath this cash right here or in the two mystery bags they got back there. They got two ginormous dollar sign mystery bags. Those are usually loaded up super good. They usually have a lot of good prizes in there, so really, really look, looking forward to winning that. We're getting a whole bunch of cash off the edge already. Oh, nice. There's a $1 chip right there. Check that out. That is awesome. Oh, my goodness. We just trick shot that cash into the play field that was on the right. That is absolutely insane. Yeah, we're about to get that $1 chip right there, and there's another one. Check that out. There's two of them. Wow, that is amazing. And I actually think we already got one of them to go over there on that right hand side. I see it laying down there. And that stack of cash got stuck in the loot chute on the right. Oh nice, there's a green earbud making its way toward the edge over there on that right side. If we can get that, I will get to turn that in. They will take all the stuff that is on the blue shelf, so they'll put it into the plate build for us. So that's super valuable. And uh, especially considering they got two dice on the blue shelves and two mystery bags. Now these little white dice up here, if you don't know what those are for, if we win those, we will get to roll them at the end of the game. Uh, whatever they land on, my winnings will multiply by those numbers, so that's very, very valuable. Oh yeah, jackpot baby nuts! Look at all that money right there. Oh my goodness. That is what I'm talking about right there. That was the mega money jackpot for sure. Yeah, all these brown and white chips that you're seeing, those are all $25,000 chips. So as you can see, we're making millions of dollars already. Yeah, once we get all this out of here, that'll definitely be our 10 million bucks back. No doubt about that whatsoever. Yeah, there's so much money approaching the edge, getting ready to go. And we're still doing decent on quarters, I guess. We got about, uh, let's see. I'm going to say like 300 quarters left out of the original 1,000 that we started with. I don't think they had a single quarter in the machine when I first started playing on this game right here. All right, let's try to get that loot chute cleared out. There's a bunch stuck in there. All right, well, we got a little bit of it. Well, that center might go eventually. But anyway, let's uh, finish out these quarters here. I'll tell you what, I'm just going to rapid fire the rest of the quarters that are in this basket. Y'all ready for this? All right, let's see what that does. That was the last of our quarters. Nice, there we go. Wow, that loot shoot is bowling over a bunch. Let's get it all cleared out of there. Yeah, a lot of times if that loose chute bowls over too much, money will fall down those little opening spaces and that would go to the owner. I wouldn't get the winner to keep any of that. Oh nice, there we go. Oh nice, we got a white earbud and we also got the green earbud and we got this uh, like dark blue earbuds so this right here actually gets us a free like cash only bonus game they'll load the whole machine up with cash for us that is awesome and matter of fact the green earbud is like over there on that right corner it's stuck we didn't win it yet so uh, anyway let's go separate all those chips that we've won and we'll get right back to work alrighty we are back let's get right back to pushing so I got that loot shoot all cleared out my goodness, talk about a mountain of $25,000 chips. My goodness, there was a bunch of money down there. We've already made our $10 million back, let's just say that. 
So I can already tell you this is going to be a brilliant game today. We're going to make so much money off of this. It's not even funny. We're going to make so much money. So uh, anyway, let's see what that does. We're doing decently well on quarters. I have not uh, cashed in the $1 chips yet, so I'm just going to try to win all these like chips that are on the left and the right side first, and then we'll turn in the $1 chips and stuff. And uh, we'll probably turn in that uh, dark blue earbud first. Sorry, I was trying to adjust the camera for you all. So yeah, if we turn in that dark blue earbud, they'll put all that cash in the machine for us. So that'll be incredible. Yeah, we might as well get that out of the way first. And then uh, we'll turn in that white earbud. That'll get us a free tower of $25,000 chips. So on top of all the $25,000 chips we've been winning out of there so far, we got a free tower made out of $25,000 chips headed our way as well, which is super nice. So uh, there should be a video out on the second channel today. Or maybe tomorrow, we'll see. I'm going to try to start uploading on that channel uh, consistently here soon. Alright, let's get that loot sheet cleared out. There we go. It's getting pretty full. Alright, so it looks like there's 125 grand. Well, no, let's see. Yeah, 125 grand and $25,000 chips. Then there's like 25 grand and five thousand dollar chips. There's there's like 150 grand in there left to win in total. Let's push that out of there and we'll be set. We'll be ready to turn in that dark blue earbud. Well, unfortunately, I opened up that dark blue earbud and the two earbuds was not in there. I mean, it's really just about like the earbud case. The two earbuds that are inside of it don't really mean anything unless you're you know like winning the earbuds and keeping them but uh, we have to turn in those earbuds for whatever they're worth which I don't know why anybody would choose or want to choose to keep a hundred dollar pair of earbuds instead of turning it in for a free tower made out of chips or something like that you get what I'm saying so uh, let's See, we just about got it all cleared out of there. This is going really, really good today. We've made so much money, and if you are enjoying this video, uh, be sure you leave a thumbs up on it and consider subscribing to the channel. I do a video like this every single day. Y'all might be seeing this video like, I don't know, later this evening or whatnot. Yeah, I'm running pretty late today. I've been super, super busy. Yeah, I've been going since like 9 o'clock this morning. And right now it's about 6 o'clock in the evening as I'm filming this video. So I apologize if this video is uh, uploaded a little bit later than usual. I'll try to get back on normal uh, schedule tomorrow. We'll also try to have a second video or a video out on the second channel tomorrow as well. So stay tuned for that. Alright, I'm just trying to win that last 25 grand out of there. It's being a little bit stubborn. Typically the last chip that's in there, it always gives you a battle. It likes to be pretty stubborn sometimes. You know what, it's always worth the challenge. It's a good feeling after you get it all cleared out of there. And uh, a lot of effort makes it all worth it. Makes you feel like you accomplished something. Oh yeah, we're going to get this thing. It's pretty close. Come on, big money. Oh, nice. There we go. We got it. We got that last $25,000 chip. So, anyway, let's go ahead and turn in that dark blue earbud and they'll load the whole machine up with cash. We'll be right back. Alrighty, we are back. Let's get right back to pushing. So, I turned in that uh, dark blue earbud and those three $1 chips, they gave me 1,500 more quarters. And as you can see, they loaded the whole machine up with cash right here. Yeah, there's tons of $100 bills, more $100 bills than anything. Well, I'd say there's just as much $20 bills as there is $100 bills. They got a big old water cash over there on the right, check that out. I think there's usually anywhere from $500 to $1,000 in those. And uh, let's see, yeah, there's a couple $10 bills on the edge, there's $50 bills. 
might be some two dollar bills in there but uh, anyway I wouldn't suggest anybody ever play these machines like I'm playing right here if I were you I would stick to the low limit machines like bringing your own quarters and stuff like that cause uh, you can really really lose a lot of money playing these and I'm not just saying that I'm being 100% honest when I say this. I've definitely lost a lot more than I'll probably ever win back playing these machines right here. Because a lot of times, I mean, yeah, I'll win $100 million here and there, or $200 million, perhaps half a billion. But then it's just like one wrong move, and all that can be gone within the matter of seconds. And I'll give you a good example. Like on the one quarter challenges, I played a one quarter challenge before the buying started off at 10 million. I ended up buying in 50 times and ended up losing half a billion like it was nothing. And if I'm not mistaken, uh, the next person to play, they did several buy-ins. They got it to go, but they didn't win no half a billion dollars out of that game, let's just say that. Yeah, the staff told me all about it. And uh, something absolutely insane happened the other day while I was playing uh, one of these machines. So basically, there was two stacks of cash on the blue shelf, right? And I won the red earbud or the green earbud, possibly. And I went to turn that in, and they were supposed to take everything that was on the blue shelf and put it into the play field for us. Have we turned in the green earbud or the red earbud, right? But uh, anyway, one of the employees pocketed the two stacks of cash that was on the blue shelf and went out of here running. And she actually ended up getting arrested for that and she got some jail time. But uh, yeah, it's just insane how these employees think they can get away with stealing. A lot of times it's like the new employees that start working here. Some of them, I don't know, you can just kind of tell when somebody's going to do something just by the way they act sometimes a lot of the employees look suspicious sometimes and 99.9% .9 of the time those are the ones that try to steal my money or cheat us out of money or whatnot so anyhow we don't got all that cash out of there already yeah that cash only bonus game is usually pretty quick like this so uh, anyway, now I'm going to go ahead and turn in that wide earbud and they'll build that free tower $25,000 chips for us. So we'll be right back. Alrighty, we are back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I cashed in that wide earbud and as you can see, they built a humongous tower in there entirely made out of $25,000 chips. Now that tower is absolutely humongous and they also like scattered a whole bunch of uh, $25,000 chips across the play field and some on the pusher back there. So, uh, yeah, wish me the best of luck. Hopefully we can win every single $25,000 chip out of there and make an absolute fortune. My goodness, we're making so much money today. But, uh, I mean, I added it all up yesterday for the year. So right now we are down around, I believe it's $1.3 billion. So hopefully we can make a lot of that back today on this game. We definitely need to win all the $25,000 chips we possibly can. Uh, last year we actually ended up being up like a billion dollars or something, so hopefully we can do that by the end of this year. But it's just like once I get a big win, I'll end up losing it. You know what I'm saying? And I don't get to keep all the winnings, of course. You have to pay taxes on it and whatnot. So I actually win way less than you all think I do. So anyway, yeah, this has been a really, really nice game today. I thought for sure it would be pretty difficult at first, which, I mean, it has been pretty much like the average difficulty game, I guess. Just trying to win all the chips out of there. They had a big old wall in there at the start of the game. That was pretty easy to knock down, honestly. Hopefully they build... You know what I would absolutely love to see in there? Like a triple or a quadruple wall. Like one wall way back there. Another one like in front of that. Then another one in front of that. Possibly another one in front of that. Like four walls of chips. Or quarters or gold in there. Whatever would be nice. 
Oh yeah, we're about to get that big old tower back there. I think we need to start loading up this left hand side. I was trying to get the excess chips out of there first before knocking down the tower. But uh, either way, we're going to get it all out of there, that's for sure. So, uh, yeah, let's keep on pushing. There's 75 grand remaining on the lower shelf. Plus a whole tower of $25,000 chips way back there. Uh, you're welcome to leave a guess in the comments. Let me know how much money you think that is back there. And there's like six chips in a row, so that is $150,000 in a row. So if you want to like add up all those rows of chips, you're welcome to. To me, I'm just going to say there's probably, I don't know, at least 50, 60, 70 rows of chips. Who knows? Like I said, if you want to count it up, just let me know how much it is down in the comments. I would greatly appreciate that. Oh yeah, we're about to get that 25 grand on the rod. It's real close to the edge. We're also going to get that tower on the pressure to go, I think. Oh yeah, it's leaning forward a little bit. Come on, big money. Wish me good luck, everybody. I just need somebody to hit that thumbs up button. Come on, everybody. Subscribe to the channel and hit that like button. Nice, there we go. That is what I'm talking about. Heck yeah, that is awesome awesome sauce right there let's get it cleared out that loot shoot my goodness that was the absolute fortune we just made right there my goodness that is absolutely insane we're gonna be rich today it's just raining ten thousand not ten thousand but twenty five thousand dollar tips out of there even better It'll be raining $10,000 chips here in a few minutes, though. You see all that on the blue shelves? Uh, we still got to turn in that green earbud. Yeah, the green earbud. So after we win all these out of here, we'll go ahead and call them back here. Turn in that green earbud. But uh, for the ones who don't know, I actually started a second channel. Well, I've had it a pretty good while, but I just never uploaded videos on it. But I'm going to start uploading videos on that channel consistently. And I actually made a video the other day on that channel showing you all the brand new machines they got here. A lot of people said they didn't like them. And then again, a lot of people said they did. So I'll be posting the videos on the new machines on the other channel. But this channel right here, the main one, it will be videos just on this particular machine right here. So I hope you all don't mind. Yeah, the second channel is called High Risk Coin Pressure. Um, it's 100% free to subscribe to that one, just like it is this one. And I will actually put a link to that channel down in the comments section on this video right here. And uh, you can just click on it and it will lead you right to that channel and you can subscribe to it if you want to. And also, you can check out that video that I did the other day. I think that video's got pretty close to 10,000 views. That's really, really good for a first video on a brand new channel. So I appreciate you all viewing that. Appreciate everybody who's went over there and subscribed to it. But yeah, like I said, I'll be posting pretty frequently on that channel. So be sure you go over there and subscribe to that one. And we do a video every single day on this channel right here. So we got it all cleared out of there. That is amazing. This has been an excellent game today so far. Alrighty, so now it's time to turn in that green earbud, so let's do that, and we'll be right back. Alrighty, we are back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I cashed in that green earbud, and they took all those towers that was on the blue shelves. They've stacked them all up into the play field here. Uh, they put most of the $10,000 chips on the moving platform back there, so those should be pretty easy to knock down. Hopefully we don't lose nothing to the blue shelf today. If we did end up losing something to the blue shelf, it would uh, cost us an extra hundred grand to have them put it back into the play field. Well, that's unless there's another like special chip in there. If there's another special chip or an earbud in the mystery bag, that will get us out of paying that hundred grand because it would automatically come with a free reset. And they put those two towers with the dice on top of them, like on the sides here. So those may be a little bit difficult to knock over. We'll see. We'll see how this game plays out. Oh my gosh. Well, we're going to have to pay a hundred grand anyway. 
We just lost like 50 grand to the blue shell. And we got one of them white dice today. So more than likely it'll be worth paying 100 grand to get like 40 grand or 50 grand. Well that mystery bag's hanging on by a string. Check that out. That is insane. Oh nice, we got the other one to go. Both of them are stuck in there. That's ah, gonna be alright. We're gonna get it all cleared out of there eventually. Everything's gonna work out just fine. Let's see what all that does. Hopefully we can get a nice push. Come on, big money. Yeah, we got a ton of quarters now. We're definitely not going to run out of quarters anytime soon today. Now we could probably play this machine for the next, like, 12 hours and still have enough quarters to keep on going. All right, let's get that loot chute cleared out. Yeah, I definitely think the mystery bag was the problem. Oh, nice. There we go. We got both of them. Check this out. So I will open up both of these here in just a minute. Well, I keep on dropping chips and quarters everywhere. I have to pick them up. But uh, anyway, let's try to knock down these two humongous towers. I'd say the one on the left is going to fall down first because it's like the closest to the edge. And who knows, one on the right might go first. That's happened a lot of times. Sometimes the closest one doesn't always go first. Oh my goodness. Let me move this basket out of the way. It's making a loud sound every time the chips fall down. Wow, there's so many $10,000 chips in there. Yeah, we've done marvelously well on this game today. Yeah, we're doing spectacular. So how's everybody's day going today? I hope y'all are doing well and having an awesome day today or not whenever you're watching this. Or perhaps sometimes, or some for somebody it might be morning, so good morning to y'all if you're watching this in the morning time. Hope you're having a good day no matter what time of day it is. And uh, hope y'all are getting ready for summer. Now the weather's been real nice recently where I'm at. Not too much rain over the past two or three days where I'm at, which is pretty good. I've been trying to enjoy some time outside, trying to enjoy the weather. Oh, nice. Check this out. There's a white dice on the edge. Nice. We got it. So, yeah, it'll definitely be worth paying the extra money for them to put that 40 grand back into the machine for us. That's what we'll be doing later on. Oh yeah, tower on the right, we're going to get it to go this time, I think. We're also going to get that white dice right there. we got to open up those two ginormous dollar sign money mystery bags as well. Stay tuned for that. That's going to be very, very exciting. That's yeah, a mystery. You never know what could be inside those mystery bags. Now, there has been a couple times that has been pretty deceiving. They would, like, fill the mystery bags up with quarters. I remember this one time they put like 50 cents in there and I asked them, does this mean anything besides just two quarters? And they said, no, it's two quarters, isn't that enough? So they were kind of like trolling me a little bit. But uh, it definitely prevents the owner from losing money when they do that by putting like quarters in the mystery bags or in other words, non-valuable stuff. I mean, two quarters is two quarters, but it's not the best price considering how much money you have to invest into these games to win. That right side's about to go, I think. Well, I think because of all that being stuck right there on the edge, it's causing us to lose a whole bunch of $10,000 chips to the gutter on the right. Yeah, that's another thing I don't think I pointed out today. If uh, any money falls down these little opening spaces on the left and the right side, that goes to the owner. I do not get to win or keep any of that. So we do got to be careful. I mean, it's really inevitable. Stuff is always consistently going to be falling down in them gutters. There's no way to prevent it. I mean, besides uh, pushing on that particular side. So if there's like a chip or two that you're trying to save, sometimes if you push on that particular side, you could save it. But uh, anyway, I don't think we're going to be able to get any of that money on the right. So we're probably better off going ahead and paying 
the extra 100 grand. So anyhow, before we do that though, I'm gonna open up the mystery bags right here. Let's start with this one right here. Let's check this thing out, see what we've won today. Hopefully it's a lot of good and valuable stuff in this one. Oh my gosh, it feels like it's loaded up pretty good. Oh my goodness, wow, we got a whole bunch of $1 chips. Look at this. So we got two more $1 chips, so that's a thousand more quarters, I'll take it. And we got two more white dice and a silver dice. So the white dice multiply our winnings, the silver dice that will multiply our quarters by whatever it lands on. And we also got 20 grand in chips, I will take it. So that's really, really good right there. So now let's move on to the second mystery bag. Uh, hopefully this one is loaded up just as good, if not better than the first one. Hopefully it's loaded up a little bit better. Much more dice in this mystery bag would really put the icing on the cake. So let's see what we won. Oh my goodness, wow. This one was loaded up a lot better. So we got the dollar sign keychain. This right here could be worth a dollar all the way up to one billion dollars. So that is exciting. I'll ask them about that later on. And uh, we got two more one dollar chips. It's a thousand extra quarters there. You can't beat that. And look at all these dice that we won. We got three more white dice, two silver dice, and three gold dice. So those golden dice there, that obviously multiplies the gold bars by whatever they land on. Wow, that is absolutely incredible. This has been a marvelous game today so far. Both of those mystery bags were super successful. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and turn in the four $1 chips, pay the 100 grand for them to rearrange that and take that off of the blue shelf. And uh, we'll be right back. Stay tuned, you all. Alrighty, we are back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I called the staff back here, and I paid that extra $100,000 buy-in. And uh, they took all that stuff that we lost to the blue shelf, including all that money that was on the right side. They just, like, put it all in a different spot. It looks to me like they just scattered the chips across the whole field. So, I mean, it should be fairly easy to win all this out of here. Let's just hope none of the chips fall down the gutters, nor get stuck on the corners there. So let's just push across the whole field nice and evenly. Try to put at least like three or four or five dollars in there at a time. About like that many quarters at once is good when you're just trying to get spare chips out of there. There's really no benefit in putting more than that in there. If you put more than like that in there, you're just wasting quarters really. But then again, the quarters are used to try to win the chips out of this game here. Quarters don't have much value considering what you're trying to win because each one of these orange chips is 10 grand each. It says it on there. And uh, at the end of the game, we count all that up and uh, we cash it in for real money and stuff. And those dice that we won, that has the potential to multiply all those chips by a whole bunch so say we've won let's say one ten thousand dollar chip for example say the white dice total up to 20 that means just one of these chips would be worth two million dollars that's if the white dice total up to 20 so and that just goes to show you how valuable each one of those actually are when you've won a whole bunch of dice like that so i hope i've explained everything okay i'm pretty tired right now like I said, I've been super busy all, all day, like outside and stuff like that. And plus, I didn't really get that much sleep last night, so. But uh, it's not going to stop me from getting a video for you all. I know you all wait on me every single day to post these super entertaining videos, so I hope you enjoy this one. Right, let's get that last 10 grand out of there. We'll be set. Well, hey, at least no chips got stuck on the corner this time. Nice, there we go. We got it. We got it all cleared out of there today. This has been an excellent game today. Absolutely excellent. We've made so much money off of this game. I can't wait to see how much we've won in total. So, uh, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call them back here. They'll put all them dice that we've won on the pressure. we got to roll them on down to here and whatever numbers are facing upwards. That's going to multiply our winnings and our golden quarters by those numbers. 
So let's see how many dice we've won in total so far. Be right back. All right, so we ended up winning 14 dice in total. We got eight of the white dice, three silver dice, and three gold dice. Now they'll put all 14 of them dice on the pressure back there. We got to roll them on down to here. Whatever numbers you're facing upwards, that's going to be our multipliers for this game right here. So let's call the staff back here, have them line up the dice on the pressure, and we'll get right back to it. I'll see you all in just a moment. Alrighty, we are back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I called the staff back here, and uh, they put all 14 of them dice on the pressure. So let's roll them on down to that lower shelf. Hopefully they all end on some really good numbers. Well, they're doing decent so far. Well, except for the uh, three ones we got. I think we only got three ones. Yeah. So the ones don't count at all, by the way. Just pretend those don't exist. However, we went on everything from two to six. Nice, that last one landed on a five. Look at that. So anyhow, the majority of them dice did pretty good. So I'm going to count everything up. Multiply our winnings and our gold and our quarters by all that. And I'll let y'all know what we ended up winning today. From a ten million and one hundred thousand dollar buy-in, we'll be right back. Oh, I'm not gonna believe how much money I ended up profiting today from a ten point one million dollar buy-in. Oh my goodness, I don't even know what to say right now. I am absolutely shocked. So I ended up winning thirty-three million four hundred and eleven thousand five hundred and fifty dollars. That is the chips, the cash, and the value of that keychain all put together. The keychain was only worth like 50 bucks today. So that's where the other $50 come in at. So uh, anyway, that's still decent. It's much better than a dollar, you know, because it has the potential to only be worth one dollar. But anyhow, um, the white dice today totaled up to 24. So I'm going to get to multiply all that by 24. And you all are not going to believe this. I ended up winning $801,877,200 today from a $10.1 million buy-in. That means we ended up profiting $791,777,200. Oh my gosh. That right there is a humongous, gigantic, life-changing jackpot win today that is absolutely phenomenal hands down one of the best games i've played in the past few days or the past couple weeks actually so yeah that is a marvelous win today be sure you leave a thumbs up on the video if you enjoyed that and uh surprisingly we won zero ounces of gold today this is like the second time this week that they've uh put gold dice in there without putting any gold bars in there so I don't really understand why they do that. But anyway, just ignore the gold dice. They mean absolutely nothing today, unfortunately. However, we did end up winning, I believe it was around 2,439 quarters. And the silver dice totaled up to six. So in total, I ended up winning 14,634 quarters. Let's divide that by four to get the dollar amount. That means we got $3,658.50 in quarters. So that's a decent win for the quarters right there. I'll take it. So uh, anyhow, that right there is not bad, not bad at all for a $10.1 million buy-in. So if y'all enjoyed today's episode, uh, be sure you leave a like on it, hit that subscribe button, and turn on the bell icon that way you're notified for future videos. And if you want to check out a whole entire playlist of my videos, uh, that will appear at the bottom right of the screen there. And if you want to check out yesterday's video, the previous video, that will appear at the bottom left of the screen. And uh, if you want to check out the video that I posted the other day on my second channel, that will appear at the top left of the screen there. And lastly, if you want to subscribe to my channel, uh, you can click the button at the top right there. So with all that being said, I will see you all on tomorrow's video. And stay tuned for the video that I'm going to be posting on the second channel, either tonight or tomorrow. So I will see you all on the next video. You all take care and have a fantastic day.